Hi guys, this is Roman Nechi Filmmaker and oh, in this video I would like to show you how I do color correction in ProRes RAW. Uh, I film uh, with Panasonic G6 5.7K 30 frames uh, with Atomos V Plus ProRes RAW. I use 2000 ISO because I need big dy dynamic range. I film uh, forest amazing forest in Redwood National State Park in California and it was a morning so yeah just would like to show you how I do color correction so for example this is how look footage we import this footage to um, Premiere Pro but we need to change our color space because it's like by default color space uh, uh, BT 709 like rec 709 but I film with a uh, lock V lock Panasonic V lock V gamut V lock so and this is how look um, footage bl almost black and white but yeah I will show you how I do color correction I created preset already and I just put in put preset past attributes and this is how look image I think it looks amazing like in a fairy tale fairy tale image you know this is wide angle lens and I put some filter on this lens I put cinematic uh, fog filter and also even I put two filters like uh, black diffusion very strong filter and cinematic and also foggy filter so in it's great like really fairy tale atmosphere but uh, we see um, sort of for example if you check this image we see um, a little bit black on the corners this is from filter because it's ultra white uh, ultra wide wide angle lens like uh, mm, six millimeter micro for third wide angle lens lower six millimeters so it's like full frame 12, 12 millimeters so it's new lens 2000 I bought this lens in 2023 around 500 or something or 600 so and this is lens nice quality lens you know with a super wide angle lens and usually I check I check I check footage yeah sometimes when we push recording in a on the camera we s we have shakiness so I cut this shakiness and now again we see a very flat image so we're going to color space che check in our correct color space we go mode we lock and now we see how we film and I put so first of all uh, I use we lock raw gamut to we lock v gamma so this is Vlog to Rov, Rov Vlog, <coughs> Rov Vlog, um, a lot, I use this lot, something changed, something changed, but not a little bit, but l just a little bit, not a lot. So what I do here, so I usually give a lot of contrast, saturation, makes a little bit warmer because it's like sunny morning foggy sunny morning and now I need to also give my contrast I usually use cur curves and like 
doing like this in the middle and also like this increase a little bit exposure okay maybe a little bit highlights down and a little bit whites for more more dynamic range for more more dynamic range so yeah this is how look image later i will i will crop a little bit crop corners to remove black corners again i will check And this is our preset, so we can uh, actually copy this preset and use to in another footage. Maybe I reduce a little bit temperature because too too yellow. Twenty is okay. Maybe twenty five. this is how look image somebody will tell this image a little bit saturated but you know when it's sunny when it's sunny forest when it's sunny in the forest especially in the morning leaves looking very green because sun sun bright sun give saturation more saturation to to, to to the green color or even any color so because when sunny weather colors vi more vibrant more saturated but not too much you need to be careful maybe i will do like 185 yeah 185 it's okay copy and again we checked between footage if it's not if you, if you see for shakiness no shakiness so again go to ProRes of settings and change color space to our correct color space Viga mood and put our color correction and this is how look image I think it's look amazing yeah later I will crop because it's a little bit black in the corners from a filter because it's super wide angle lens I, I put two filters so so let's check between footages no shakiness okay so again change to Vigamut past attributes yeah it's really foggy forest really sunny foggy forest so i put filter so it looks like in a, in a dreamy fairy tale you know and uh, i like it actually i like it with the filters and without filters i like it more again so maybe we can also put uh, our color corrections but we see a big overexposure because we need to change our um, profile 
we use vigamut we lock and this is how look image it's look amazing amazing uh, forest so this is ProRes ROV we see a little bit noise because we use 2000 ISO in a black magic but but um, but it's, it's okay it looks like more cinematic because usually in cinema footage we see some noise this makes cinematic image and uh, it's it's okay it's fine noise you know it's not big big noise but it looks really cinematic noise you know okay guys this is how we do color correction uh, prores rov 5.7k from panasonic uh 5.7k from panasonic and atomos v plus and it's amazing quality i like this quality i see very deep colors you know it's 12 bit colors prores rov 12 bit colors and I, I see very very deep and nice quality image nice colors so i like 10, 10 bit color so for me filming 8 bit it's just you know it's not good uh, i prefer at least 10 bit color 10 12 or even 14 because its colors look very deep and prores rov give very deep colors i think it's a little bit better quality than prores so i think maybe in future we'll compare prores and prores rov okay guys thank you bye bye oh yeah subscribe if you like and if you're interested um, what we do and how we film and how we do color correction you know how we film nature video because we concentrated more on in on nature video so we uh, i am landscape nature filmmaker almost 10 years so in this channels i also just if i have time show people how we film how we, which equipment we use and also how we do color corrections and we edited this uh, footage on computer uh, apple m2 24 gig it's not max pro just apple m just uh, just apple pro m2 no max yeah, apple pro m2 24 gig it's not expensive not so expensive like around two grand but it handles perfectly fine prores row because it's apple format so prores row for and prores is apple formats and apple handle well this formats okay guys thank you bye